Well, the 750 um, is a new design this year. It's the same hull shape as the 24. Same cross beams, same floats. It's got a new deck mold, and the new deck mold incorporates a full bow sprint without the whisker stays that the Mark II had, or the uh, Mark I for that matter. 750 has the highest power to rate ratio of any of the Corsair boats uh, because it has more sail area and it's lighter weight. The mast on this boat is roughly three feet taller than a Mark II, and uh, it's roughly three to 400 pounds lighter weight. So the combination of more sail area and lighter weight just gives it a lot more power. Um, it's the most affordable of the Corsair trimarans. It's also the lightest, so it's uh, a lot easier to set up and to trailer and to go from trailering to sailing mode, you know, raise the mast and all that. The other thing I think that uh, is very popular is the huge cockpit. It's actually, even though it's the smallest Corsair, it has the largest cockpit. And so it's an ideal day sailor uh, with really very little pretension to be a cruiser. And the other thing is it's just really lively to sail. When I take people out for a test sail from the women is how much they appreciate the fact that the boat doesn't heel over a lot. And they feel a lot more secure moving around on the boat that it's not gonna suddenly you know, tip over on them. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm a person of uh, over 50 myself and I feel I'm still, I'm just learning how to get the most performance out of these boats. And we have a lot of people uh, in their 60s and 70s that own them. Uh, I had, have had people that have been overweight when they bought the boat and they've told me that it's changed their life and that they've gone on a diet, exercised, and it's opened up a whole new avenue to them, a physical activity that they thought they were past. as a uh, great fun day sailor and the uh, sportiest boat of the bunch for the racing guys. And I would really hope we see a lot of guys getting into this uh, class as a one design racer because it certainly has the ability to be the uh, most fun two or three man race boat in the Corsair line. The biggest appeal of this boat for uh, family sailing is the size of the cockpit. There are a lot of people who get nervous about getting out of the cockpit, coming out on the nets or out on the floats and the size of the cockpit, you could easily have half a dozen people there and not, not feel cramped. The other thing about the Corsair is, is the you know, ability to go into very shallow water. So for instance, right now, we could just pull up over here to this beach, lift up the daggerboard and the rudder, and take the boat right up on the beach and step off on the sand and you know, go have a picnic or something. Okay, well right now we're, we're seeing this, the wind's coming in here about maybe 10 knots, maybe 12. We've, we're healed over to a maximum of maybe five to ten degrees, very comfortable, and uh, you know we're not getting splashed, we're kind of relaxed here on the net. I really like it. The um, reason I like it is because it is so simple. This is a boat that I can take out by myself or one other person with no problem. It's a great boat.